You called my name and I ran out of that grave. Hey guys, tonight it's Saturday night, it's late at night, and what am I doing? I am setting up because I got a couple new microphones and I want to show you the SM7B that I just got and I'm going to show you my CAD95 and uh, not necessarily sure why there's water all over the sanctuary, big rain, but tonight I am checking these mics and I'm going to show you my trick for getting my vocals to sound the way I want them to in the room, okay? This is beyond my tech guys who do an amazing job, but I want to set them up for success. I want to hear what I sound like. Hey, I just want to know that I sound good. I want to know that my mic's working, and this is what I do. Uh, my mixer's there, the room's pretty long, so I ran cables to right about here. Then I stand out here, I sing, I listen, I move around, I listen, I do different things, I go back, I EQ, I listen, I compress, I listen until I'm really comfortable. Then, in the morning, when uh, my techs get here, I'll tell them, you know, hey, I've got this kind of set, check it out, listen to it, make some tweaks. When they listen to the band, they'll tweak it a little bit, but it's, it's definitely a way to get your confidence in what you sound like. I think it's important as a worship leader, as a vocalist, to really know your mic, really know your sound, and be really confident with what's going on in, in your voice. All right, so check out these mics. All right, I have a couple mics. This right here is my new SM7B. I'm using it in my studio, I talked about it. Uh, this is my guitar mic, I brought this 57 to stick on there. And this is my favorite mic. This is the CAD 95. Man, this thing's beat up, sounds amazing. It's, it's, it's um, a condenser mic, it's a stage condenser. It sounds really good. Uh, so what I do is I take a, a cable, I run from the back of the console just out to the room and you can see I kind of ran them out there. I stretch them all the way out in the middle and I set them up and I listen to them. So I got both mics, I grab them. I'm using this 95 because it's my mic. It's the mic I like. So let's come out here. I'll move around the room a little bit and this sounds really tight. This is the SM7, sounds pretty good. So I'll just move these around and you call my name. And I ran out of that grave, out of the darkness, into your glorious day. You called my name. I needed shelter. I was an orphan. But you called me a citizen of heaven. I'll just move around and I'll just sing until I get the right feel for the room and the mic and the placement that I want. Again, I think it's extremely important for me as a vocalist, as a musician, to feel comfortable singing in that mic. Uh, and, and it's funny because the SM7B and my CAD95 sound so similar. They feel so right. I mean, I had the CAD95 dialed in really well, and now I have the SM7B dialed in. I'll show you uh, the EQs. Here they are. In this console, the X32, I can actually pull up my EQ and uh, I can save my EQ. Okay, so I can pull it up and save it. This is this is my EQ, channel 22, Eric 95. Okay, and then I took the other channel and uh, this is Eric SM7B. And look, I, I really have barely done much of anything on this. It sounds really good.